So the reason we came here today was to go down into the tunnels to confirm if our plans are accurate as to where all of our piping for the steam comes out, for the condensate returns, and where all of the air handling units are down below. Uh, and another reason to explore this is to see if there are any other opportunities rather even more efficient than just hot water conversion. So we could look into geothermal or find out what other potential solutions there might be. And they actually opened, I think, in 65. Mm -hmm. So That's probably right. So it's not that the building is extremely old, but if the boiler needs replacement anyway, because it's highly inefficient, um, then that should sort of led us down the path of what other opportunities might there be now the costs have come down for other alternative heating, non-traditional heating mechanisms. Anything you can think of that's green or environmental that is going to bring the best technologies, the best experience, the best case studies together, what works in Minnesota? Because the more you pay for energy, that's one less teacher. So those are the kind of the equivalents that we look at is if we can save money doing being proactive, we can keep more staff on board to provide the academics, which is our mission.